Hey guys, if you own a small business, you're self-employed, you're a 1099 employee, do not stop watching this video. This is very important stuff. March 28th, the Biden administration made a final ruling on short-term medical uh, policies, which are the policies where small self-employed people, small business owners, 1099 employees goes directly go directly to the insurance plans. Uh, these are the plans that I specialize in. Um, these plans do save you money because you go directly to the insurance carrier and you cut the government out. So why would, we're going to do two videos on this, so I want to keep them short, short and sweet. Um, the first video is going to be why. Why would, why, would the, why would this matter to the Biden administration? There's everything else going on in this world. Why would this be at the hottest topic? And the second part of that would be why is the media not telling us about us? But I think you guys know the answer to that. So why? Why are these so threatening? Well, they're threatening because number one, it allows you, the small business owner, to go out on your own. And small business owners might have some perks with, with that. And, and it behooves the government for you to work for somebody because you can't hide any of your income or, or, or you know, write off your expenses or whatnot. But that, that's not what we're talking about today. Um, the second thing it does is it forces you to go to the, to the, to the marketplace. And in the marketplace... It's it's basic socialism, guys. The people got this group of people paying more, this group of people paying less. Then basically, it's taken from the taken from the, the haves and given it to the have-nots. Now, some of you are gonna put cut nasty comments below. At the end of the day, there's way more to it than that. But nuts and bolts, bare bones. If they don't have people paying more than what they need, then 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 how can they give people give it to people for nothing? So. Bottom line, guys, um, the solution the solution is going to be simply put: we have till September first. Um, at after September first, that limits these plans to one policy for three months, and that's it. You're done. Um, right now, I can still write a policy for three years, so up to three years. So, give me a call. Let's talk about it. Um, the next video I'm going to go through, if you and take the time before you watch the next video, take the time and go read again the, the links in the description below. Go read what the White House says about these policies. And, and, and it is so obvious that they think you guys are stupid. Um, you know, the pre existing condition, it attacks pre existing conditions. A little, little uh, preview of the next video. They attack the pre existing condition. Guys, the only way you can have a pre-existing condition is if you've been diagnosed. So if you don't, if you think you might have a pre-existing condition, but you never had a doctor say you have cancer or you have diabetes or you have this or you have that, then it's not pre-existing. And but yet they want you to believe that if there's something going on inside of you and you buy one of these policies, it's not going to be it's, it's not going to be covered this far from the truth. They're lying to you. They're lying to you to force you to the ACA plans. It forces you to go go to work for benefits or pay a smoking high premium for to be self-employed. Um, you guys remember this was a big deal when Obamacare came along. All of a sudden it went away. Why did it go away? Well, we had four years of, 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 of a more conservative president who took all of that away, took all those rules away. So bottom line, watch the next video if you want to, want to hear my take on, on, on their accusations of why these plans are so bad but know that if you want to do this this is something that you need to get done between now and september or the door shut temporarily probably um if we see administration change i think we'll see some changes um uh, the insurance carriers themselves aren't going to put up with this they're going to come back and they're going to come swing and they're going to create products they have workarounds they're going to lobby congress they're going to do the things that we know will get it backed into the center but for right now, and as of September 1st, we're going to the far left. Um, I'm taking politics out of it. Doesn't matter if you're Republican or Democrat. If you're self-employed, you want to spend pennies on the dollar for your insurance, you better call me and you better call me before September 1st. Um, please remember to like, subscribe, comment, positive, negative, I don't care. Um, and for the love of God, give me a call.